What is mold? Most people use the word mold, but don't know what it actually is. First, it's a word used to describe over 100,000 species of fungus. Second, it's both a particle and an organism. So when people use the word mold, it's hard to know if they are talking about the particle, the organism, or the general classification of mold itself. This blanket term sets up people to use phrases like mold is everywhere. When people say mold is everywhere, it means that because there are over 100,000 species of mold producing particles, there's always some level of mold spores that will end up in your environment. That is true. But this does not mean that you shouldn't take steps to prevent mold from growing inside your home. The real problem is when we allow non-living mold particles inside our homes to become living organisms by providing them the opportunity to do so. When the environment is conducive for growth, mold will transition from a particle into an organism, much like how a seed becomes a plant. When this occurs, the living organism that is now inside your home produces more and more particles. And among these particles could be a toxic byproduct called mycotoxins. This is so important because most of the homes that we are brought in to fix have between five and 10 areas that are conducive for mold growth and need to be repaired. When we look at all these areas that could have mold growing and producing particles that are getting into our body with each breath that we take, we can see why the goal is removing sources creating these particles, making sure these areas are no longer conducive for mold growth and then removing the existing particles that are opportunistically entering the body. When you break things down so simply, you'll see that this isn't such a mystical subject and something can be done about it. The goal here isn't to kill anything or to build a bubble around the home. It's actually to correct the ability for mold to grow in the first place, to improve the conditions of the home so that mold no longer grows inside the home and to remove the particles you're exposed to. I hope by following the mold medic principles outlined in this video, you are one step closer to building a healthier environment and a healthier, happier you. Health begins at home.